kind of crazy game you would have seen over your time, given the start and the finish? Yeah, um, I, I don't think I've seen one that that weird. Really, I haven't. Um, so right up there, right up there, you know, right up there with 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 uh, the weirdness of of the whole game. Um, I don't really know what to say as far as the offense goes, and not being able to put the ball in and not not look uh, close a lot doing it on on some shots. But I do know what to say about the defense. The defense kept on plugging and plugging and plugging, um, you know, all the way. Like I, it, you guys probably thinking the same thing that how how are we anywhere within shouting distance um, for the first three quarters of that game with the shooting percentages? So um, they really they really did a good job fighting on defense. What's, what does it say about them if they can have that effort defensively in light of? Well, it, it it says like you know I think everybody's well aware we're going through a really difficult patch maybe maybe the most difficult patch we've been through, um, and they're you know like like I say to you guys they're 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 fighting and trying and they're trying to execute the the game plan and they're and they're hanging in there right I think I think that uh, the um, offensive woes probably would have caught up with us. Um, you know, maybe a few weeks ago or a month ago and got to our defense, but it didn't seem to tonight. So, you mentioned, the turn. Sorry. Uh, you mentioned how some of the shots weren't very close, even though they were fairly decent shots. Um, is that a team that when the shots start to pile up, when the missed shots start to yeah, pile I mean, up, you start to think about them? I mean, I, th I think so. I think that, um, it, you know, it's a lot like a lot of things. I think it gets a little contagious, right? Like, you know, we, we had some, you know, again, uh, and, and it just kind of started spreading, you know, and we're trying try to, you know, sneak a few other guys in there and, and maybe, you know, see if they'd relax and, and vault up and knock one down, and that didn't seem to help much either. So it just one of those things that spread. and And um, you know, just like uh, the start of the overtime was a great synopsis of the game. We get three stops and two wide open threes and one wide open, um, you know, like eight, 12 footer and, and we got nothing to show for it. You know, and then we're, and we're down, then we fall down two. Um, you know, after about three minutes of play, right? So, so that was really a synopsis of the game. And, and I kind of thought we'd maybe kind of broke the dam open there you know, uh, certainly had with just just kind of pace and kick and taking shots and having some having some success with some things. What do you make of the Scotty sort of quiet until he comes yeah. on late? Uh, yeah, uh, well, you know, was we, we, we yeah, of that. it what, was what do you make? that was well, we 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 need him we need him to be uh, again more aggressive from from start to finish. Is that, I mean, how much does playing a guy like Lopez where you really have to consider the push and pull of when do I force a shot, when do I not play into his role in particular tonight? Well, I think that um, the thing about it is he ended up having some success right on him at the front of the rim, right? And I think I would probably, we probably looking back on it now, we'd explore that early to just say, okay, let's go, let's go try to get into him and, and challenge him. Or, you know, probably take few, a few more of the wide, wide open threes that he was given. Like, you know, we're not, we're not telling him not to shoot those for sure, right? I mean, we don't want 20 of them, but but got to got to try to keep them a little bit on us so we can we can um, you know just not let them do exactly what he wants to do out there. The second game in a row where you get seven from the bench. As long as the, the best five scorers are, are starting, you're probably not going to get big scoring totals from some of those guys off the bench, but what do you need from them to be able to impact the game more? Well, I think that, uh, you know, I mentioned it um, the other day, it's it's um, they got to be a, a lot more solid um, defensively, first of all, right? To, to not just, if they're not going to uh, score in stretches, they've got to make sure they're not just giving it away quickly, like, they, like a little bit happened in Indiana the other night, right? Um, but, you know, like... Um, 
you know, Malachi's had some good games where he's made some open shots. Chris has. Need, need, to, need to make a few more. You know, Precious gets back in the swing of things. I thought he had a couple decent looks and drives and stuff that, that you know, needs to, needs to finish. He had a couple, uh, uh, at least one nice roll and lob, you know, and just, just they got to they gotta make some of those. Josh, that's it. Chris got drilled by a screen in the second Yes, he did. Uh, looked like it wasn't called out by his teammates. Um, is that true? Is that something you guys discussed? Well, it was a little bit of a weird play. I think uh, Chris ended up crashing the glass and and decided to stay up on Giannis, right? And I think I think that 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 kind of threw off the matchups a little bit in back. I'm not sure anybody was guarding that screener yeah. yet or way up at that point, right, to communicate it. Yeah. So no one to call it. I, I don't know. I got to look at it. Yeah, he got to get hit hard though, from you know, kind of blindsided, right? Coach, you had an early challenge in the first quarter. Um, did you do that intentionally in terms of like wanting to set the tone for the rest of the game, or Russ taking closer looks? At well, I mean, I think I think you're always going to get. Um, um, Giannis with his share of collisions down there and you're never quite sure you know what your guys are doing wrong other than taking a punishment right and that one I didn't get a great look at it on the original one but Pascal was you know obviously saying it was all ball and I got a quick look on it on the screen and thought I had about a 70% chance of getting it right Right, just from the call basis, and um, also setting a little bit of an early tone that you know we actually can stop stop him possibly. Right, we actually could you know strip it clean tonight. What did you think of your defense against him? A lot of points, but 12 turnovers is a career high for him. Uh, it was outstanding. It was outstanding. Yep. You mentioned Malachi earlier. I mean, he, he had some good moments over the last few weeks, but probably not so many of them here over the last couple of games. How, how tough is it with, with young players like that to kind of live through the ups and the downs? Well, I think I think that um, what you said is exactly right, Josh. He's, he, he had a nice stretch there, really impacted games. Um, I think that... You know, uh, it is still probably a pretty small sample size, but that's kind of he's he's kind of nights when he's hot and when he's not, right? And and um, he's certainly going to impact games the nights he's, he is, and he's not going to impact them very much when he's not. And that's the simple data that I can go from right now. The 16 wins, uh, 38 games. It's the fewest since the 2012-13 season. What have you seen from the past couple games that gives you hope that you and your team can turn it around for the remainder of the season? Well, I, I still say that um, we've got to um, continue to, to to play to our identity, which is playing you know playing pretty good, solid defense and giving ourselves a chance. Um, and I. I think, I mean, I haven't watched the tape yet, but I think there's a lot of makeable shots out there. We've just got to, we just got to get some over this hump of, of um, guys that career-wise have, have shot the ball a lot better, right? Uh, and I think, I think those shots are there. I think we're creating them. There's not some, like, major thing. I think the major thing is, is we've got to get some confidence back at that end, and I think that feeds, feeds that way. I, I, again, I have to look at it a little bit more closely, which I will. But it's simple as that, man. We got to put the ball in the bucket a little bit more. Yeah. Did you ever get that close to pulling the starters and saying this one's over? Uh, no, not yet. I, I, it was still it was still too too early for me for that. Thanks very much, okay, everybody. Thanks a lot.